Hey guys, welcome back to Button Smashing. Welcome back to Phoenix Wright. I'm Spotted Menace. I'm sitting here with Daria. And we're, we're still doing, lawyers! We're still lawyers and we're doing voices. Enjoy. <clears throat> Wait, uh, I gotta do this one, right? Right? Mm. I, I'm asking. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hold on a second. I don't know what I did. <clears throat> Wanna clear all that other throat? Yeah. <laughs> Um, we're professional, if you haven't noticed, by the way. <clears throat> Witness your name, please. April May. At your service. You gotta say the wink. Wink. There you go. Rabble, rabble, rabble. Okay, again, oh my god, this is gonna kill me. Wait. Order. Stop vibrating. <laughs> An introduction should not require any reaction from the crowd. Who stands like that? No, no human. <laughs> Please continue. Gonna move on. The witness will refrain from wanton winking. <laughs> what the shit? <laughs> wanton winking. This is a shit show court. Okay. Okay. Oh yes, Your Honor. This is not good. She's already captured the heart of every man in this courtroom. <laughs> Tell us, where were you on the night of September 5th when the, well, hmm. Did you say September 5th? 5th. One, two, three, four, fifth. <laughs> Tell us, where were you on the night of September 5th when the murder occurred? September 5th. Um, gee, I was like in my hotel room. Tee-hee. <laughs> Tee okay. I checked in right after lunch. And this hotel is directly across from the Fay and Company Law Offices. Oh! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> mm. That's right, big boy! Big boy. Okay. Please testify to the court about what you saw. Wait! That's gonna hurt your throat. <laughs> it was like nine o'clock at night. I looked out the window, you know. And then, oh, I saw a woman with long hair being attacked. The one attacking her was this mousy girl sitting in the defense chair. Her right there, matter of fact. I almost thought you said her right there, motherfucker. <laughs> That's what you were about to say. <laughs> Remarkably solid testimony. Is it? Not really, but yeah, okay. But okay. We're, we're gonna move on. I don't see a need to trouble the witness any. Uh, no, we're gonna trouble the witness. Wait, Your Honor. Yes, Mr. Wright. God damn it. What about my cross examination? Yeah, let me let's question that. Oh, I, I thought the witness's testimony just now was quite um yes. Firm, yes. Very firm. Didn't you? So now you want to make him a sexual deviant predator? I mean, like, you know, we've, we said hard evidence and now it's firm. So I, I'm going to keep that. All right. <laughs> Mr. Wright, I understand you were Miss Mia Faye's understudy, were you not? Again, what does it have to do with We will you? find out. We will find out. You must know her techniques well. Who gives a shit, dude? Her cowardly way of finding tiny faults and perfectly good testimonies. Whoa, you need to take Bitch. several steps back. Bitch, have a seat, ho. Because what is that about? Continue. Hey, how dare you? Well, Mr. Wright, will you cross-examine this witness? Yes, motherfucker. Yes. Uh, 
Okay. Yes. Well, yes. Uh, I'll I'll gladly proceed with the cross examination. If only because I have a feeling Edgeworth doesn't want me to. She has to have some weakness. Well, very well. You may begin your cross examination. <laughs> witnesses account okay all right hey. it was like nine o'clock at night i looked out the window you know okay move on and then ooh, i saw a woman with long hair being attacked okay the one attacking her was a mousy girl sitting in the defendant's chair okay hold on one sec um pressure on that you think something's L1. there yeah i think something's there okay hold it how do you know she was the defendant Girly. Uh huh. Women know these things. Look, I, I just know, okay? There was only one person at the scene of the crime with a short girlish figure, What's and it? it wasn't me. It should have been. The testimony is bulletproof, Your Honor. He's right. Hmm. Do we question, question the testimony. That? Keep questioning it. Don't keep pressing. Hold on a minute. That testimony stinks. What? what? Miss May, I'm willing to bet that you're, you're lying. lying. I think she's lying. Yeah, you're lying. Okay. Go for that. Are you telling the truth? Did you really see the defendant? Uh rabble, 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 rabble. Mr. Wright, what's the meaning of this? Hmm. Yes! What is the meaning? Somebody tell me because I'm clueless about this, I mean. Okay. If you had really witnessed my client, Maya Faye, you would have noticed her clothes before noticing her physique. Yeah, because she was dressed like a medium. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Twitch, twitch, twitch. <laughs> twitch. Twitch, twitch, twitch. Twitch. All right. No one wears clothes like this on a daily basis except her. And I'm no expert on fashion, but her hairdo looks far from normal to me. However, the witness's testimony mentions neither of those things. It really doesn't. Yeah, that's a good point. The testimony is bogus. Still, we don't know if she was dressed that way the night of the murder. She was. She was arrested that way. What Wait, are you talking yeah, about? Yeah. Hold on one second. Keep going. We're going to figure it out. She was, Your Honor. I saw her. And so did Detective Gumshoe. What do you say to that, Miss May? Rawr. What are you trying to say, you mean lawyer? I, I saw what I saw. I just didn't think all the trifling little details were necessary, darling. Miss May. <laughs> These voices. Yeah. The court would like to remind you to please omit nothing in your testimony. I'm sorry, Your Honor. I'll be a good girl. I promise. Wink. Thank you. Your testimony again, if you would. Damn, I almost had her. We still got her. Yeah, we'll get her. All right, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Witness testimony! Yeah, this is all you right Witnesses there. Witnesses account! I did see everything. I did. <laughs> the victim, the woman, dodged the first attack and ran off to the right. Then the girl in the hippie clothes ran after her. How do you know they're hippie? Just, okay. yeah, we're gonna find something. And she hit her with that weapon. I saw it. I did. That, that clock. Um, the kind of statue -y clock. The thinker, I think. Mm-hmm. Well, does the accuracy of my report not startle you? Tee-hee. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, I love making you say tee hee. And, and weak for apparently. <laughs> I see. I only wish you had been so detailed from the beginning. Please begin the cross examination. When does this account? Okay, so she said that the thinker was a clock, but okay. everybody's been calling it a statue. Right. So go to that statement. Okay, I did see everything I did. The victim, the woman dodged it for a second, ran off to the right. Then the girl in the hippie clothes ran after her, mm -hmm. and she hit her with the weapon. I saw it, I did. That, that clock. Right there. So, so R1. I'm presenting? Yeah, we're gonna present the clock. Okay. So let's go over to there. Ba-bam. Triangle. Thank you. Objection! Miss May, what you said just now was quite revealing. Revealing? Ooh. You like that when you naughty Mr. Lawyer. You just said that this statue of the thinker was a clock. But there's no way of knowing that just by looking at it. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Keep your eye twitching up. Mm. Another person in much the same position as you recently called this a clock too. And he was found guilty of murder, murder. Murder! Order, order. Miss May, can you explain how you knew this was a clock? Ooh, uh, twitch, 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 twitch. Twitchy twitch, objection! The witness saw the murder with her own eyes. That's all that's important here. No, it's not. Not really, no. We need to get the de details right. The defense is trying to confuse the issue with trivial concerns. No, he's not. You just want to be a bastard. Yes, yes, of course. You will withdraw your question, Mr. Wright. Why? Objection! But questions are all I have, Your Honor. And as you may recall, I've caught murderers with these questions before. Well, a murderer, but okay. Okay, because because you do have a plural for murderers. Oh, yeah, you only had the like the one. Case, one but, murderer. Yeah. Yeah. Well, only, they, they, even he admits it. Well, only once. Dude, we're gonna work on you later. Dot 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 dot. Objection sustained. You may oh shit. You may continue to question the witness. You all right over there? Yeah. That was a weird burp out of nowhere. Okay. Uh, whew, that was close. If he stopped me there, the trial would be over. You think? Huh? What? So what happens now? What happens now is you answer my question. How did you know it was a clock? So you've been to the law offices of Faye and Company. <laughs> no! Hey! I didn't say that! Why would I go there? I heard it from my old telephone! Hee <laughs> hee. Pause. Okay. That's a loud ass fucking clock if you heard it all the way from your hotel yeah. across the damn street. I highly doubt you heard that. But from but your hotel. We, we will but, continue, okay. but we will continue. Okay, go ahead. And considering would she on a different floor? Yeah, but like we had a lot, we had a lot of inconsistencies. But let's okay. let's, let's move on. The law offices of Fay and Company, where the murder took place, is very close to the hotel. Not where you can hear the time <laughs> of a clock. She could easily have heard that clock. So the windows in a hotel must be really thin, or Maya's. That's a loud ass fucking clock. Okay. But no. <sighs> well, Mr. Wright, are you satisfied? No. Damn that neck roll. No, Your Honor. I can't give up now. I'm not satisfied because she couldn't have heard it ring. It couldn't have rung. It couldn't have rung. It couldn't have rung. That one. Because remember? Oh, They right. emptied it out mm -hmm. that last case. Your Honor, members of the court, it is inconceivable that the clock in question rang because it's empty. That clock is missing its clockwork. 
Thank you for that. How could you possibly? Just take a look right now. I mean, please, Your Honor, because I don't want to sound like I'm insubordinate or anything I'm held in contempt of court by ordering you to do something. But now please. you're concerned about being insubordinate. I know, right? Oh. See anything interesting, Your Honor? It is as the defense says. Empty. This clock is missing its clockwork. So. Bitch. You have been caught. It's quite empty. Just okay. like my soul. Robba, 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 robba. Mr. Wright, would you care to explain the court the meaning of this? Why do I have to explain the meaning? It is as you can see. The clock was empty. It couldn't have rung. Therefore, this witness is a big, fat liar. Hey! We will continue to fuck ourselves next time on Button Smashing. This case is getting interesting. It is. It's getting a little interesting. Yep. We will catch you later. Deuces. Bye.